Hello everyone, welcome to the So Much Tech channel. 3D printers are becoming faster and producing much better quality, so there's never been a better time to get started in the industry. Printers can be used for so many projects, from cosplay to small business ventures, that having at least one in your home just makes sense. In today's video, we will break down the top 5 best 3D printers you can buy this year, based on online reviews, product quality, and price. For more information on the product, I've included links in the description down below. So, let's get started. Number 1. Bamboo Lab P1S Bamboo Lab's P1S boasts an astounding maximum print speed of 500 mm per second. Supported by an acceleration rate of 20,000 mm per second, the holy grail of modern 3D printers. Just how quick is that? Suggesting that the turbo button be called ludicrous mode will suffice. Its regular print pace is approximately five times quicker than older bed slingers, and it can produce a high-quality pace of Benchy in 17 minutes. Although it may not be the most cost-effective printer, it offers the greatest experience for both novice and expert makers right out of the box. When it comes to Bamboo Labs printers, the P1S is like the Goldilocks model. It has all the functionality you need for quick, high-quality prints without breaking the bank. It's a Core XY printer, so it prints quickly and smoothly. To handle materials that are sensitive to heat, such as ABS and ASA, it has a fully enclosed design and a metal hot tend with a direct drive extruder. It comes nearly fully constructed, making it one of the rare plug-and-play 3D printers available. The printer just requires unboxing and unpacking. It adjusts its settings as well. The machine's $699 price tag might put some people out of their price range. Instead of worrying about the technical aspects of 3D printing, the P1S is an excellent choice if you want a machine that gets the job done. If you're looking for a printer that can print in a variety of colors, the automatic multicolor system is an excellent alternative that is exclusive to Bamboo Lab printers. Their P1S fantastic results were achieved, including the rapid printing of vibrant action figures, RC car nylon gears, and ASA household equipment. Although it had to reduce its speed to print TPU, the end product was just perfect. Number 2. Creality K1 A new high-speed printer has captured the hearts of the 3D printing community, and Creality's K1 is aiming to do the same. Creality has launched a new, fully contained Core XY machine that is both fast and fully enclosed, clearly in reaction to the competition. It has an acceleration rate of 20,000 mm per second and a maximum print speed of 600 mm per second. In just 15 minutes, it can produce a high-quality pace, Benchy, and its regular print pace is approximately five times quicker than that of traditional bed slingers. Similar to Bamboo Lab's open frame P1P, the K1 retails for $599. Using a USB stick or your own LAN, you can avoid unreliable cloud printing on the K1, which is just as quick as the P1P and P1S, but has a superior interface. Core XY machines, like the K1, are lightning fast and Creality hasn't dabbled in this manner, since the disastrous Ender 7. This machine can now create high-quality output at twice the speed, thanks to Clipper's input shaping. It can handle ABS and ASA, two materials that are sensitive to heat, thanks to its container, its Sprite Direct Drive Extruder, and its all-metal hot tend with a custom Volcano-style nozzle. It comes nearly fully constructed, making it one of the rare plug-and-play 3D printers available. The printer just requires unboxing and unpacking. Just like its competitor at Bamboo Labs, it has the ability to self-calibrate. Number 3. Monoprice Voxel The Monoprice Voxel 3D Printer is an excellent pick for anyone wanting to begin 3D printing on a budget because it produces high-quality prints without breaking the bank. If you're just starting out, the Voxel's heated print base will make printing with materials like ABS much easier and more reliable. Prints may be easily removed because the print bed top slides out and is also bendable. It's worth noting that the voxel is contained, which is a key factor to consider when using a 3D printer in a home or classroom setting. When compared to other, more costly printers, the MP voxel is lightning fast. The print's high quality, which faithfully reproduced details and captured the contours of real objects, was another thing that struck me. A few hiccups during setup are to be expected, but once everything is in working order, the MP voxel is the ideal 3D printer for beginners. Number four. Form Labs Form 3 Plus. Although cheaper alternatives have entered the resin based printer market recently, Form Labs Form 3 Plus 
is still the go-to machine for anyone who routinely prints out 3D models. I used to recommend the Form 3 as the best resin printer, but I now prefer the Form 3 Plus. Not only is this updated version easier to use, but it also produces prints at a considerably faster rate. A floating level sensor monitors the resin level in the print tray and controls the flow to ensure that each job uses the exact quantity of resin, making resin loading a breeze. Eliminating prints is made easier with a more adaptable build platform. Not only does the Form 3 Plus print at a rapid pace, but the quality of those prints is very exceptional. With a starting price of $2,500 due to a price bump, it's obvious that this model isn't affordable for everyone. However, for designers with the means to invest in this premium alternative and a constant requirement for aesthetically pleasing prints, Form 3 Plus more than suffices. Number 5. Minga Magician X2 a competent, feature-rich 3D printer does not need a hefty price tag for beginners and hobbyists. There are several budget options, such as the Elegoo Mars 2 Pro, but if you're looking for a cheap 3D printer that nonetheless delivers on performance, consider the Mingda Magician X2. For those just starting off, this has a lot of great features. Some features that make it easy for beginners to use include a removable PEI build platform, filament identification, a fast swap extruder, and 16-point auto-leveling. You will also find the touchscreen LCD to do a fantastic job of showing important information, like the temperature of the hotbed, and letting you make modifications, like simple baby step Z-axis tuning, that made printing much easier. In addition to producing consistently high-quality prints, the printer itself performs admirably. The print times, though, seem too long to me. Even though it's capable of speeds of up to 100 mm per second, 60 mm per second is where it really shines. When compared, the Lightning Fast Bamboo Lab P1S can achieve print speeds of 500 mm per second. The restricted nozzle options and the need to fine tune for better print quality are compromises that come with being on the inexpensive side. Having said that, the value you receive for your money is quite remarkable. So that's it for the best 3D printers of this year. Like, comment, and subscribe to receive notifications of our latest videos.